All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duel. So today is Friday. That means that we are playing them kaijus, and hopefully things go okay. Because lately I've been getting, like, super countered. Like, holy crap. Like, you think I'd be doing the countering, being the asshole here, but damn, like, the people are, some people are just like, nah, fuck you and your kaiju. Like, okay, all right. <laughs> anyway, uh, look at the title. It's called Transcript because, uh, yeah, I was having a problem, a huge problem with the situation I was running into with uh, transcripts and just dealing with college and university and business in general. You know how it is. So, uh, I actually partook in my first uh, class of 300 and it was meh. It really was. It was, it was just meh. So, alright, so this summons this and this. We'll get a search. All right, so he's doing his electromagnetic warrior place. Pretty powerful. We'll probably go into Gorgonic Guardian, I'm assuming, because, I mean, rock level three, rank, rank threes, let's go, you know. Gorgonic Guardian's power, so I'm not be surprised. I mean, I got Kaijus to handle that, so, you know, that's nothing. So I'll probably just go ahead and play this and then be like, reveal I'm playing Kaijus. I mean, really, it's just the back row. The back row is going to be what's probably going to hurt me here. It's not generally monstrous. Wow, not Gorgonic Guardian. All right. Once per turn, you can attach a Xero from this card and tell you one spell a trap. It cannot be activated while this card's face upon the field. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. No, that's fine. Because <laughs> I'm just going to trip you off and then activate it. So that, that's nothing. So you want to go ahead and step on my card? That's fine. It's really the back row. Like monsters? No problem. I got that. But the back row? Hmm. That might, this might be a little bit difficult. Really. Might actually be difficult. So next turn, he can summon this guy. I don't, I don't remember what the new uh, electromagnetic big warrior guy is. Can he like banish like ABC or is it just cards he controls? I don't remember. It might be banish or cards he control are banished. Like either way, that'd be really a really powerful play. So, uh, so I pretty much got a uh, an email from a counselor saying like, hey, did you ever go to UNLV? UNLV is the university of my city university of las vegas um so pretty much you graduate from high school you can either go to what, what used to be community college but it's not community college anymore uh, it's called it used to be called community college of southern Nevada. now it's just college of southern Nevada because they actually you can actually stay there for longer for like dental programs but really it's just your first two years and then you'll go over to unlv or university for your next two for your bachelor's degree but uh, I didn't, I never went to UNLV. I went to C, from CSN straight over to National, so more of a private university. Uh, but they emailed me and they're like, hey, have you, have you ever went to, uh, to National? And I'm, I mean, have you ever went to UNLV? And I'm like, no, I never took any classes at UNLV. And they're like, well, we, you know, we're running into a problem. Apparently you do, or you got to get a letter on enrollment. So, uh, pretty much what, how it went down is that, uh, despite me never going to UNLV and never running into this situation before, I actually had to, uh, so you're not on the field anymore, so I should be able to play this, right? It says, while this card is on the field, yep, so give it back to me. So thank you, thank you. I'll go ahead and take my, uh, Kaiju Destroyer, like, jizz, my jizz. <laughs> I, I wonder uh, what TCP was thinking, like, it, it, it is clearly <laughs> Jizu Curry, so just jizz. <laughs> All right, so he's gonna select one monster in your grave in your deck, send it, and then go ahead and flip 500. It's fine. So Rock Bombardment, of course, gets this giant century of stone set up. So that's pretty power. Oh, and then play Wallaku. Okay, that's fine. So, because <laughs> I mean, I mean, sure, you were gonna take a nice 33 to the chin. So I guess that's fine. So I have a normal summon. I could just go ahead and summon my glow ball. And then make a like make a Leo. Like that'd be pretty power. Pretty power to go ahead and have a Leo right now because I'm assuming that next turn he's gonna go into his one uh Gorgonic Guardian, which of course targets and you can't target me because I'm Leo. So, so I think I'll go ahead and do that. So sync Oh wait, that's Star Eater. I can't add. I can't add. I can't add. <laughs> I mean, it's still fine. Better than just leaving them there, but yeah, I clearly cannot add. So, what what were you again? You were ten. I, I ran them in here because lithium ran them in here, but I don't I don't remember how you I don't remember anything about Nirvana. I tell me one tuner, one tuner, Synchro Monster. Oh yeah, I can do that. So I guess I'll just go ahead and go into that. Like I said, there's no twelve that I can do, so I guess I'll just go ahead and set this. Like 
I don't know why. I was like, I was like, yeah, you know, uh, let me go into Leo, cause ten plus one equals ten. Fucking idiot, Daniel. <laughs> I ran through my mind. I, I think I just probably forgot what level Leo was. Like Star Eater is the one that's that's the generic eleven. Not not Leo. Leo would have been great right now, cause I'm probably gonna get Gorg. Oh, and he's gonna attempt to hit me with the Gorgonic Guardian. So you search for. Or do you do anything? Yeah, you search for the level eight one, so that's fine. You search for the big magnet warrior. I would I would like to play this on daily duels. Yeah, you can banish it from your hand, field, or graveyard to summon him. Mm. Mm, probably should have solemn striked him. I didn't know if it's hand, hand, field, or graveyard. So that's uh, pretty power. Uh, this is this, what he's doing right now. It's pretty power. Of course, it's kind of like a true born farm frog, so that's that's power as well. So he can turn this into a Gorgonic Guardian, even if I stop him, he can just banish that. Because I think I think he's gonna go into Gorgonic Guardian, of course. Because the Star Eater don't do shit against that, so. So you can I'm gonna say I'm gonna say no to this, but you could just be like, alright, well I'll just summon my uh big magnet word by banishing these three. And I don't I don't remember what he does. I think he like pops or something. Uh, another rock bombardment. Do you really need all that rock bombardment? Oh yeah, block. I forgot about block dragon. Yeah, block dragon. Completely forgot about him. So, are you gonna summon block dragon? Or are you gonna summon your big gear freed guy, the Verzian? It's by banishing one blah blah blah. You got those. You can banish one level four level monster from a graveyard. Target one card. Your opponent controls. Destroy it. Yep. Yeah, you can do that. This card will be destroyed by battle or. Possession card effect, you can go ahead and summon all them back. Yep. So, I was like, no, I never went to UNLV. I never took any UNLV classes, but they were like, well, we can't accept that. You need to get a, a letter of non-registration, you know, non-enrollment. So, uh, I never went to UNLV before in my entire life. Had to drive all the way down there. Oh, he's got to summon Black Dragon. Yep. Nice uh, 3,000 booty, this card. What do you do? <laughs> I don't even know. You banish the blah, 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 the blah, blah, blah. This card is sent from the field to get a period. All right, you can add up to three rock type monsters from your deck to your hand, whose total level equals eight. Mm, it's pretty power. Up to three, I guess. Go ahead and plus. So I kill him, and he goes to graveyard and gets seven pluses. Like, like you're giving the rock some serious power. I would totally not mind uh, uh, trying this deck out on daily duels. I believe next week is when the deck suggestions and all that shit goes up. I believe so. So. Yeah, this Sunday it should go up, deck suggestions and all that, you know. You know the routine for June. So I drove down to UNLV, it got hella lost, hella lost. Uh, I had to drive past the strip, and I was like, wait, wait, did we pass it? And it's like, no, you actually, it's like in the heart of the strip, like right in the middle. I never went to UNLV before. I had to park in a parking lodge and garage and go to the lady and... Apparently, I was like, I need to learn on enrollment. I never signed up for UNLV. I've never been in any UNLV classes. The lady was like, uh, actually, you have. And I was like, what? What are you talking about? Like, no, 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 I haven't. She's like, yeah. Uh, apparently, a class that I took senior year of high school. It's been a while since I've been in high school. It's been it's been four years since I've been in high school. But my senior year of high school, there's a class that I took. Is uh, I call it the Lego class. You're looking at Block Dragon. Ah, the Lego class. Wow. So look at all that that he gets to add. That's power. So... He gets to add himself a Medusa Worm, which I believe when it's flipped, he gets to destroy a monster. Yeah, once per turn you can flip this card and pay them. When this card is flip summoned, flip summoned, so flip that pop uh, card. Uh, no, monster I'm trying to fill, that's power. Uh, does that target? No, it doesn't look like it targets either. Uh, and then two of his Magnet Warriors. That's pretty power, so. No, so he gets to summon his Black Dragon and then get hella plus, hella plus. Like, mmm. Mmm. Uh, that's it. I'm, I mean, I'm playing freaking kaijus. I'm kind of slow. I kind of went into my synchro kaiju because I wanted to get a little bit more aggressive with it. So, even if I would have used one of my kaijus and sent him, I mean, of course, I still would have. Uh, he still would have been sent from field to the graveyard. So it really didn't matter what I did to block coat on my uh, the block dragon. Like I said he has plays for days. Like I wouldn't be surprised if he li literally kicks the shit out of me right now. So, with this high school class that I took senior year, it gave me college credit at UNLV. So, technically, I did take a class at UNLV, not that it was for my major or anything like that. 
but it was interesting that it uh that it came like that made a boo boo. Really? I mean, it's, I mean, you still got resources and plays for days, so I wouldn't be surprised if you kicked the living crap out of me. So, like, you could easily, you could probably game me right now, and there's nothing I could do about it. <laughs> and it's nice that I, oh, you made two boo boos. Oh, okay. I mean, will it cause you to lose this duel? I mean, I've done no freaking damage to you, so you might have plays. <laughs> You know, it might be best just to go ahead and actually summon Gamaseal off over his monster. No, no, he's gonna go ahead and summon his uh his yep, his Rizion, so. Rizion, go ahead and uh banish pop me. Yep. Now if I was Leo, Leo would have been great, but it's GG I think, yeah. That's probably a game. Yep, go ahead and summon your block dragon back. Yep, yep, that's game. I got nothing. No, I would like to surrender. <laughs> God damn. I'm just too slow. I was just, really, I was just too slow for him. You know, them, them new uh, mag electromagnetic warriors, they're pretty quick. They are, they're like ABC, so. Let's get another dual bear back. God, it's really hard for kaijus to stand alone, be a standalone deck. They're just so slow, you know? That's how you probably need to throw in, like, I'd probably say you send you. At this point, yeah, I'd say you send you. I can go ahead and get my pokes in, or say you send you much, they return to my hand, you know? But, Kaju, they're just kind of slow on their own, so. Hmm. Alright, playing the Lightsorn Sentry, going against Lightsorns. Fake Card Friday, review the Lightsorn monster, and now I'm playing against Lightsorn. It's awesome. <sighs> go ahead and play your Charge of Light Brigade, yep. I'm assuming you probably get like Illumina, Lumina, Pitch, Summon Raiden, Raiden use your effect, mill some more, go into like maybe like, oh no, get a Raiden. I thought maybe gonna get a Lumina. But no. Nope. Just gonna go summon Raiden, Raiden mill, then during the end phase mill, so. I don't even know what, I don't even remember what this field spell even I mean this continuous spell even does. What turn you can send one line once on your grandma and track one line on your hand your hand. Uh time so the shrine kind of just protect her from being destroyed. I don't care. So pretty much he gets a light sword monster to die. You can send a light sword monster to get a light sword monster. Okay, that's not even a plus. It's not it's not great. It's not terrible either. So I'm gonna send Felice and get another Raiden. Okay. At least you can't get JD back. <laughs> like, <laughs> like I am totally fine with what you're doing right now. Like, okay. So I guess I'll go ahead and activate my waterfront. Then activate MST. Pop your set card, because I don't want you to have your set card and start building up counters on my waterfront. That's that's pretty powerful. So you see this set card? I don't really care about your Light Swan Sanctuary or whatever. I said is it's probably gonna be JD time soon. One, two. No, he only has two. Well, when I kill this right, it'll be three. But no. He doesn't have as much as they thought. Oh. You could have activated your uh, judgment and put it on top of your deck, but I guess you didn't want to do that. Alright, so I got me some counters. I guess I'll go ahead and activate Terraforming, get me some more counters. Obviously, I'm going to have to summon a Gamma Seal and then probably run it over with my Thunder King. Could I game him? No, I had to attack monsters. I had to attack monsters. That sucks. So I didn't have to attack monsters and just attack, 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 but no, I had to attack monsters, so. I guess I'll go ahead and give you Gamma Seal and then I'll give myself Thunder King. Be nicer if I have my tag out continuous spell, but I don't have it right now, so. I'll just run you over and get more Kaji counters. Like, I all five, that's great. Just, you know, what am I doing? Nothing. <laughs> I'm slow. I'm slow. Pure Kaji, that was probably a bad idea. It's just really slow. So. Thunder King, of course, doesn't protect worth shit. Like, if I had, like, my, my move brainwashing or something. Maybe even, you know, one of my tuner monsters might have been able to do something. Now, with Thunder King, I would have been able to summon and sink into Leo. Not that I would have been great, because I don't believe there's too much to target targeting Light Sorns. Alright, well, seems like he's just going to foolish for Wolf, so. Uh, then Wolf, go ahead and... No. I, okay. So, that's that's four. That's four different names right there. So, JD? JD? Go ahead. Yep. Ah, there he is. Ah, there's JD. 
Yep. Too bad I'm not. I don't have a kaiju that does anything versus JD. Yeah, I'm gonna counter counter instead. So you can keep paying thousand, but I'll just keep removing counters. Like fuck it. All right. Know some more right in. Not dead, but you know, I'm not gonna have the best of situations. I need pretty much I need to draw into a kaiju monster. Because I'm gonna, of course, summon my kaiju over JD, and then what? So I need to draw into a kaiju monster. I'm pretty much fucked. Mill a whole bunch, mill a whole bunch, so. Or, or I can play. I can play Slumber. <laughs> Alright, that, that works too. Slumber? I don't get this card that often. I really don't in this deck. Uninterrupted Slumber. Yes! <laughs> That's power, so. Go ahead and dark hole the field, and then I get a, a kaiju. Uh, I guess he used that. I guess he can use that to protect light sworn cards. Uh, control light sworn cards. Yep. So, so um, I don't know what kaiju. I guess I'll give you like jizz. No, not jizz. I'll give you. I think I get it, and then you get it. So, I'm gonna go ahead. I think I'm gonna get Thunder King. I think I want Thunder King. Because I can move three counters and attack all your monsters. Uh, move two counters, your opponent can activate card to the turn. Also, you can make up to three attacks on monsters during each battle phase this turn. So I think I'm going to take you, and you go ahead and get Dogaran. So, that's a cool way to go ahead and handle that. So I'm going to go ahead and remove three counters. One, two, three. And now I can fuck up everything. I can attack three times. That's pretty power. Of course, I'll go ahead and kill my Dogaran so you can't use the effect during your turn. And attack. And you can protect if you want to, but you're running out of resources. Oh, and then that's all I got. I guess you can't activate this. Does this activate? I'm not sure if this activates. I think it does. You can move. No, I don't think it activates. So I guess he said no. You know, because then he would have got attacked again. So that wouldn't have been the greatest of plays to get attacked again. So I'm okay right now. He's top decking. Uh, what can he top deck? What can he possibly top deck? You know, like light swarm monsters won't be great. Even top decking JD won't gain me. Okay. Okay. I'm trying to figure out where you're going with this. I I guess you you're just surrendering. I guess that's it. Ah. That unter uninterrupted slumber was so good. That's exactly what I needed. <laughs> Alright, that's game. Alright, uh, I'll get one more duel and I'll finish up my story, so we'll be right back. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I think we're doing against Mal, because it just says Mal, so... <laughs> what is he playing? I think he's playing Monarchs. <laughs> if he's playing Monarchs. <laughs> I know, I just... I was just you know, getting another duel, it's like, now it's like, all right, let's do now. <laughs> anyway, so instead of just paying simply $5 at UNLV and beating a letter of non-registration, I had to pay $10 to get a official transcript so I could transfer this one fucking class over to, uh, over to National. This one fucking class, one fucking credit, so that's fucking stupid. So on my way home, I decided to go ahead and, well, I mean, I'm not going to really do anything anyway. Like, like I'm glad that you activated this this Thunder of Ruler, so I can't conduct my battle phase, but I have literally nothing to do anyway. I can't do anything until you do something. So, <laughs> like, I don't know. I feel like you're playing something sacky now. No extra deck, this Thunder of Ruler, so I can't conduct my battle phase. Like, what is this? What is this? I mean, I, I'm not a perfect angel either. I'm playing fucking Kaiju, but, you know. What are you playing? What are you playing? <laughs> Nah, I still really can't do anything. I can't summon. I can't do shit. So, I only get a search if I send, so. I mean, I guess I could set this uninterrupted slumber, I guess, but nope. Still can't do anything. <laughs> I might start poking you in Jet Synchron. How you like that, bitch? Start taking this 500. I'll poke you 500 until you die. Like, if you don't do anything, if you don't summon monsters, turn, I'm gonna start poking you for 500. <laughs> like, fuck it. Let's go. Fuck it, Jet Synchron, get it in. <laughs> Jet Synchron, it's time. It's your time to shine. Poke him for 500. Sure, just <laughs> waste your threatening roars. I don't care. <laughs> like, really? Jet Synchron? He's too scary, huh? <clears throat> the fuck is he playing? Like, 
Okay. Ah, he actually set up monster. Good, now I can actually do something. Shit. <laughs> ah, give me that waterfront. I can actually start doing things now. Alright, so... Hmm... I can give him a kaiju, then give me a kaiju, and then... And then I guess sink. Like, that wouldn't be terrible. So, you're level 7, so I can sink 8. That wouldn't be terrible. I think I might give you, like... Jizz, because I'm not going to target. I think I'll give you Jizz. Uh, get that necroface out of here. Then I think I'll take Radian, and then Sync. Sync 8. Okay, I was about to say, like, I was like, Scar Red has to be attack less than, but Heart Red can just be uh, attack position, so. You guys Sync into Scar Right. Go ahead and activate you, blow you up. Uh, I'm getting counters. I'm starting to build up some counters. Like if I and knowing, knowing him and how Saki's deck is, if, if I drop a Gamma Seal, like that, that could probably just be game. You know. So I'll just go ahead and attack. So I went to, uh, since I was like, all right, well, I'm already getting, um, uh, you know, transcripts. So, you know, yeah, I might as well just go ahead and go over to my. Uh, other college that I went to in transfer to transfer there. I already did an official transfer once, but there was one class I didn't have finished so that I needed to be transferred over. So I did that, asked about graduation, uh, and when it came to that, please don't play Pot of Cupidity. Oh, no. You're just, you're doing something sacky. Yep, go ahead and give me that. And then you'll probably go ahead and play your fucking, uh, uh, I forgot the name of the card, but I already got it played on me once this week. Like, again? Like, again. Like, yeah, again. Let's go ahead and do it. Go ahead and play your uh, your Infernal Tempest. Yep. yep. I already got to play on me once this week, but let's go ahead and play it again, right? <laughs> like, wow. Two times in one week. And it's, and it's, and it's from Mal, too. They have a credible amount of life points, and then, of course, uh, I'll, guess I'll get gamed because I, there's no way I'm going to do nearly enough damage to game you. So. so. Wow. Just Mal being kind of sacky here. Andy has the Regeki too? Like, alright. Alright, Andy has the Regeki too. Like, wow, that was that was sacky. That was sacky. <laughs> that was that was incredibly sacky. Yeah, there's no way I can do that. Nah, not really. Like that so so Inferno and Tempest again. That's the Inferno Tempest again. That's that's just twice in one week. Twice in one week. Why are you even playing this? Like why 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 Mal? Why why are you why are you be sacky? No. <laughs> no. Yeah it is. <laughs> yeah it is. You summon grinder and you play Infernal Tempest. And then you just play block cards until you get it. Uh all right, Mal. All right, Mal. All right, Mal. All right, Mal. Like, nigga, that, how is this fun? Like, now, I guess that's game. There's no way I'm gonna do nearly as much damage to game you, and then we just kind of sit here and just pass turn until I deck out. Woo! Fun! Yeah, fun. 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 Fun! Fun. Like, this is twice in one week. That's really sad. Especially for Mal. Like, I thought he was going to play something interesting. I didn't know he was playing something sacky. If I knew he was playing something sacky, I wanted to duel him. But, I guess I'll just continue my plays. So, it's the last duel anyway. I could summon this. I could give him this. Summon this. And then, room two to get a to uh, token. Oh, wait. He can negate me. He can negate my effect. Well, I can attack him first. Hey. I guess some people just like being dirty sometimes. Like, even in my free time, even in my off time, you won't catch me doing shit like this. Like, I haven't played fucking, like, something sacky like that in, like, a cool minute. Like, since I was, like, 13. I was like, oh, yeah, Exodia's cool. Like, no, it's not. <laughs> so, I guess. 
guess I'm really, I guess I'm just, I'm, I'm done. There's no way I can inflict fucking 43,000 points of damage. Including the fact that he's still gonna have all his block cards too, but I guess I'll just duel just to duel. Anyway. Uh. Yeah. Hello? <laughs> that was, that was League. What? What was the other guy's name? What other guy? I don't, I don't remember. I don't remember. It was like on Monday. Like, I, I, I vividly remember because I beat him. I don't remember. I don't remember. This was like on Monday's, uh, it was. I was wrong. I was all MST this other side card because it's probably the same fucking card. Like I said, it's probably like I said, it's probably the same fucking card. I don't remember. I, I don't remember now. Like literally this was like Monday. And why would I remember someone who's playing something sacky? Like, hey, remember that one memorable duel where that guy was playing something sacky? Remember his name? No. <laughs> no, not at all. I mean, I got some damage right now. Like, this is damage, but I can't. I don't think I'm gonna flick that much. Especially since he can get polyduality and, you know, reveal into another Wabaku. Like, maybe I'll, one of these days, maybe I'll get lucky and then he'll, he won't draw into something that blocks my attack. Ooh, actually, you know what? Actually, you know what? I might, no, I don't have any monsters left in my deck. I would say I could tag out for fucking uh, Gamma Seal. Like, no, I can't. There's no Gamma Seals in my fucking deck. Like, right. I might as well move two counters and get me another token. And then one of these days, maybe he won't get lucky and I can just, you know, dunk in and I can't even summon these guys because I just can't summon, period. So, I'll say, if I could just activate this and then tag out. You could target one target in one country month and build a strong target and special summon with a different name from your deck. Yet I can still activate it? Or I guess it's saying, why can I activate this? Hmm. I'm curious. I might do it next turn, but I don't. I shouldn't have any more Kaiju monsters. So why can I activate this? Maybe the second effect. Oh, I can destroy it. Yeah, the second effect. Once a turn. No, the second effect. You can send this card with three more Kaiju counters. Add one Kaiju spell or trap from your deck to your hand. All right, all right. I'm getting kind of sick and tired of this duel. Yeah, I'm getting real sick and tired of this duel. Every time I do something, now it's just like nah, nah, nah. So. I'm done. I'm done. Anyway, um, the new class, I don't like it. I don't like it. In comparison to my first class, like, the co the teacher teaches, he's a psychology teacher, he's gonna try to get us to, you know, critically think. We're kind of butting heads at, as teachers, and I don't know, you know. Uh, he, he, he's trying to encourage that the class is a hybrid, even though it's not. Like, I'm, I signed up for online. But they want it to be a hybrid, and he's like, oh, yeah, come in each week. I'm not coming each week. Like, it's literally, like, a half an hour to an hour long drive across town not doing that. I'm just pretty much just going to stay home and do the work, turn it in. And maybe the last class I might come in, but, yeah, I got to just this class. I'm not really liking the teacher. I don't think I, I don't want to deal with him every week, you know? Like, no, it's not my cup of tea. I'm in there for two hours. I don't like it, and it's not fun, you know? So I'm just going to do all my work, turn it in, and be done with it. It's only a month long. He's not going to be one of the memorable professors. I'm just going to move on to the next class, you know? So, anyway, I'm done. I apologize about now. Like, I, I wanted to get a decent duel in. We opened up well and, you know, I wanted to do some kaiju plays, but now it's just like, nah, Infernal Tempest again. So, it's twice in one week. Awesome. Only in Yu-Gi-Oh, really. Only in Yu-Gi-Oh. So, anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. So, uh, anyway, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you guys uh, tomorrow if I'm on my live stream. Uh, make it if you can. And uh, on uh, next week with some more Daily Duels, like I said, the deck suggestions should go up on Sunday. And the polls should go up on Thursday? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yeah, on Thursday. Uh, it should go up on Thursday. And we'll see, you know. Uh, we can have these decks stay for another month, or we can have different decks, you, you know, we'll find out. So, uh, yeah, anyway, next Wednesday is my birthday. This one's done. All right, people, thanks for watching.